everyone, I'm Melissa. And I'm Ava. Hi everyone again. And we're going to show you some gymnastics today. Now thank you very much if you joined us last week and did some teddy bear rolls. And well done if you've been practicing those at home. We'd love to see some. Today we're going to focus on balancing. So what we need to do first is we need to start our warm up again and make sure we're nice and ready and nice and stretched for our gymnastics today. Just make sure you've got lots of space around you as always and make sure that you're on a nice soft surface like carpet or a mat. Right then, just see if you can follow the shapes that Ava and I are making with our bodies and we'll try and warm ourselves up nicely and make sure that we're all ready to start our gymnastics. Okay, so we're going to bring our feet together, we're going to stretch our arms up to the ceiling and we're going to see if we can make big circles all the way around. Remember painting those circles? Very good. And forwards again, we're going to paint our circles forwards. Very good stretching guys, well done. And we're going to stretch up to the ceiling as tall as we can. Reach those fingers up and we're going to reach forward and see if we can touch our toes. Lovely. And stretching up to the ceiling again. Reach those fingers up nice and tall. And then reaching forward and see if we can touch those toes. Fantastic. Right, for our next stretch we're going to sit on our bottoms. So we did this shape last week. Can you remember what this one's called? That's it. This one's our pike sit. So we need to make sure we're sitting up nice and tall. And we're going to see if we can make big circles with our feet round and round. Lovely. And the other way, see if you can circle those feet, paint big circles. And then we're going to see if we can point our toes down to the floor. So that's our pointy toes. And then we're going to lift our toes up to the ceiling. And that's called flex toes or flex feet in gymnastics. So we're going to point and flex and point and flex. And if you're feeling clever, see if you can point one and flex one. Oh, well done. And shall we see if we can do it the other way around? So point the other foot. Lovely. That's it, Ava. Very good. Then we're going to do our big tall stretch up to the ceiling. See if we can sit up really tall, stretch those fingers. And we're going to see if we can reach down as far as we can to do our fold without letting our legs bend. And then we're going to hold the stretch. Very good. And we're going to stretch up once more. Big stretch up. And we're going to reach forward. Remember, keep those legs super straight. And we're going to hold the stretch. Fantastic. And the last bit of our warm-up we're going to do, we're going to kneel up on our knees. We're going to clasp our hands together and make a ball. And we're going to see if we can go round and round with our wrists. That's it. And keeping our fingers clasped together, we're going to see if we can make big waves. So see if we can make waves in the sea. Very good. How big can you make your waves? Wow, that's it. And then we're going to give our hands a shake. Shakey shake. And we're going to give our feet a shake. Shakey shake. Shake shake. Very good. And we should all feel ready for our gymnastics now. So what we're going to focus on today is balancing. Now there are lots of types of different balances in gymnastics, so we're just going to show you a few today. Okay, so what I'd like you to do is I'd like you to go and find something nice and small, nice and soft that you can use to pop on your head when we're doing our balancing. Now Ava's got a cuddly toy. Ava, do you want to go get your cuddly toy? That's it. And something this size is perfect. Do you want to show, show everyone what you've got? So Ava's got her little cuddly toy whale. And you could have a ball of socks or anything that's nice and small that you think you can pop on your head and try and balance on your head. Okay, so we're going to put those down on the floor for now. So I'm going to give you a second just to go and get anything that you want to get. You can pause the video if you want to to give you a bit of extra time. Fantastic. Now what we're going to do, we're going to pop those things down on the floor for a moment in front of us because we don't need them quite yet. And we're just going to go and try a few balances that we use in gymnastics first, okay? So the first balance we're going to try today is called a T balance. And that's because 
it looks like we're making a capital T or a capital T with our bodies. So for a T balance, we must start with our feet together. Oh, very good, Ava. Then we're going to bring our arms lovely and wide. So we're going to stretch them out to the side. And then we're going to slowly lift one leg and see if we can balance. Very good. Now, if you're finding that a bit tricky, because it is a bit tricky, you're only standing on one leg, then see if you can find something in front of you to look at. And as you lift your leg up, you're going to see if you can keep looking at that object. So keep looking at that one thing in front of you. That's it. Can you do that, Ava? Can you see if you can keep looking at one thing in front of you? Oh, very good. Ava's looking at her toy. That's it. And if you can do it really nicely on one leg, should we have a try on the other leg? Yeah, so keep those arms out to the side. And this time we're going to keep looking at that object in front of us. And we're going to lift the other leg up. Oh, brilliant. That's it. Have a try. See which leg is easier to lift or easier to balance on. That's it. And then try the other leg and see which one you find easier. Fantastic. Right, so that one was called our tea balance. Tea balance. So well done if you had to go at that one. The next balance we're going to try is called our V-sit balance. So for this one, we need to get back onto our bottoms. Now this one is a bit of a tricky one. So what I'm going to do is I'm just going to turn to the side. You guys can stay sitting where you are, but I'm going to turn to the side so that you can see me. So we're going to sit in our pike sit with nice straight legs and our back nice and straight. And then we're going to bring our arms behind us and try and put them flat on the floor. That's it. Are you going to try that one over? See if you can do that. That's it. Bring our arms behind us. That's it. And then when our arms, our hands are nice and flat on the floor, we're going to slowly try and lift our legs up. See if we can lift those legs. So we're balancing on our bottoms. Very good. And that one's called a V-sit because we're making the letter V or V with our bodies. So let's try that one again. So we're going to sit in our pipe, sit nice and tall. Then we're going to bring our arms behind us. That's it, Ava. And then we're going to slowly try and lift our legs. Very good. And if you can do that one quite easily, you can make it a bit trickier by seeing if you can lift your hands off as well. So we still start in the same shape. We place our hands on the floor behind us. We lift our legs and then we see if we can lift our hands too. Oh, very good if you're having a try of that one. Well done. You should feel your tummy muscles getting nice and strong doing that one. Oh, super try, Ava. Brilliant. So that was our V-sit shape. So what we're going to try and do now is we're going to see if we can try and get those balances even more steady by using our cuddly toys or our ball of socks to put on our head. So I'd like you to stand up and take your cuddly toy and then you're going to see if you can balance your cuddly toy on your head. That's it. So you can ask your grown up to help you. Shall I help you balance your cuddly toy on your head, Ava? That's it. So we're turning this way, I think. So we've got to keep looking straight ahead so then it's not going to fall off. That's it. Head up a little bit, Ava. That's it. Awesome. Now I'd like you to see if you can try your tea balance without your cuddly toy falling off. Oh, he wants to go for a swim, doesn't he? Shall we try that one again? Yeah. So see if you can do big wide arms. You have a go at your big wide arms, Ava. And keep looking straight ahead. Oh, nearly. That's it. Very good. Well done. So the key to that one is keeping your head super, super still. So we've got to try and keep our head as still as we can. Shall we try that one once more, Ava? So keep looking straight ahead. That's it. We're going to keep looking straight ahead and then we're going to try our T balance. So big wide arms. Look at that leg. Very good. Well done, Ava. That was brilliant. Good girl. He stayed there for quite a while that time, didn't he? Fantastic. Right, we're going to use the toy again for our V sit this time. So remember for our V sit, that's it. Ava's going to be my demonstrator for this one. So we're going to sit facing that way, Ava, into your pike sit. That's it. 
and we're going to squeeze our legs together that's it and then we're going to pop our hands behind us i'm just going to hold on to the toy for now that's it so remember the shape for our v-sit we need to keep our hands nice and flat on the floor and try and see if you can get your fingers pointing away from you yeah and what we're going to try this time is we're going to see if we can start with the cuddly toy on our ankles and we're going to see if we can lift our feet and get them to roll all the way down to our tummies. Shall we have a try? Go on then, Ava, have a try. So we're going to lift our feet. That's it, lift those feet up. Yeah, fantastic. That's it, and have another try. So this time, see if you can do it even higher. So let's see if we can make that slope even higher with our legs. Are you ready? So squeeze those legs together. And we're going to lift those legs up, squeeze those legs together nice and straight. That's it, make sure we're keeping those legs super straight. Should we have one more try? That's it, pop those hands behind us. Remember, fingers facing away, brilliant. And then we're gonna slowly lift those legs up, super straight legs. See if we can get them super high, super high. Oh, fantastic. Well done, guys, if you had a try of that one at home. And that's when you can practice all through the week, just making sure that you've got lots of space around you. And there's no objects around you that you can fall on or that can fall on you. So we're always thinking about keeping safe. Well, thank you very much for joining us today, guys. We're just going to do a little cool down now to make sure we're nice and calm and that we're ready to go on to our next activities after our gymnastics. So what I'd like you to do is I'd like you to keep your legs together like we do in our warm up and our arms by our sides. That's it, we can pop our cuddly toys on the floor for now. See if we can stretch up to the ceiling. And we're gonna slowly bring one arm down by our side as slowly as we can. That's it. And then we're gonna bring the other arm down to our side as slowly as we can. Brilliant, and then we're gonna reach forward really slowly. That's it, keeping those legs straight. And back up really slowly. Well done. And we're gonna sit on our bottoms again. We're going to stretch our legs out in front of us. That's it. And we're going to see if we can slowly stretch our hands to our feet. That's it. And stretch them back stretch our hands to our feet and stretch them back and we're going to lay down on our backs so maybe can you show us that's it take yourself around this way making sure we're on mat and we're going to lay ourselves right down on our backs as if we're going to go to sleep brilliant squeezing our legs together that's it and then we're going to slowly lift one leg up to the ceiling and back down and the other leg up to the ceiling. And back down. And then we're going to stretch both arms up to our ears so that we're stretching up to the ceiling. And back down. And both arms up to the ceiling. That's it. And back down. And then we're just going to have a calm 10 seconds. Just relaxing, we can close our eyes if we want to, thinking about how hard our muscles have worked, how well we focus on our gymnastics today. And when you feel like you're nice and relaxed, slowly come up. Ah, oh, there we go. Well, thank you very much, everyone. Hopefully, you feel nice and relaxed now. And hopefully you enjoyed all your gymnastics today and you can have a try of all those balances and all those things we did today in the video at home. Just make sure you let your grown-ups know and make sure you've got a nice safe area to do it in. Well, thank you very much for joining us today, guys. We'll see you very, very soon. Bye-bye. Say bye-bye, Ava. Bye.